This video is for the young men out there that's trapped inside relationships, that's trapped inside marriages, that they really don't need to be in, that they really don't want to be in. Um, we've heard over time that so many women are in abusive relationships, but nobody really talks about the men that's in abusive relationships. You just don't hear it. Now, I'm saying abusive for a reason. This is for YouTube purpose, I'm saying abusive. But there are so many men out there that's in abusive relationships. I know of a couple. As a matter of fact, this one young man, he's in an abusive relationship and he's with this female that loves to put her hands on him. But when he goes to restrain her, she threatens to call the police on him and says that he is abusing her. You even have females that were attack themselves they would claw themselves up they would punch themselves in the face and then they would call the police and say that the young man did it just to go to jail now they do this to tie his hands see because people may think well how can a guy be abused how could a guy be physically abused by a woman simple if she get inside his head and make him think that if he try to restrain her if he puts his hands on her, then I'm going to call the police because you know how they think towards black men. You know what they think towards black men. So all I got to do is say that you did this to me or you did that to me and they're going to take you to jail. Right. So because of that, you have so many dudes that's trapped and now they're at the mercy of this female. Right. I think what the major problem is, is in this day and time, you got so many feet, you got so many dudes that's getting involved with women and females with their heart. Men should never get involved in a relationship with their heart. Leave your heart out of it. Always use your mind and you never let a female get inside your head. Never do that because once she gets inside your head, once you go into a relationship with your heart, then you're in captivity. You're now in her clutches. She can do anything. She can manipulate you and form you to what she wants you to be. So if she goes out and have an affair on you, you would still take her back and you would still defend her even in her wrong. Now, this young man I'm talking about, this female haul off and slap the mess out of him. His other child's moms was there and she was about to get inside this female's behind and she was like you know why would you do that to him so she goes to attack this girl he steps in front of his child's moms to protect this abuser from abusing him right so you have dudes out there that's caught up with that sickness and i think like i said i think that what the problem is you got a lot of dudes now that's getting involved with these females with their heart. And you can't do that. I watch over a period of time, I watch young men change. I came up in an era where women wanted, um, they wanted a gentleman. Men treated them like they were queens. Then a time came when the female no longer wanted the gentleman. He was weak to her. She wanted the thug, she wanted the criminal. She wanted the dude that was in and out of prison, right? She didn't mind taking care package up, up to him. She didn't mind taking care of him. She didn't mind him living under her and her kids. She didn't mind him driving her car, contributing nothing. Then as time went on, then she wanted the guy that was sagging his pants, his pants hanging down his butt. She didn't mind the emotional dude. She didn't want, she didn't mind the dude that, that didn't mind or had no problem getting in touch with his emotions, being emotional. So now we have all of these beta male dudes that's emotional. Now the females are complaining, they don't want that, right? So over a course of time, you see where females start forming dudes to be what they wanted them to be, right? Now they complain about it. Every single dude that they create Every dude that females create, the females still end up being unhappy with it, right? But see, keep in mind, 
women were made for men, not men for women. I repeat that in a different way. Women were made for the benefit of men, not benefit of the woman. So now you have all of these females that's making demands of these dudes. He's got to have so much money. He's got to do this for me. I saw a video just this past week where this female was saying that when she meet a dude, she's not going to give it up to him. But every dude she meet and that she's interested in or that's interested in her, he has to go down on her. But she don't give nothing in return. And then she says, do him make it 100 grand a year ain't enough for her. And she wouldn't even consider dude that's making $75,000 a year. And I'm looking at her like, well, what do you have to bring to the table? What do you have to offer? And look at this female. She's not, she wouldn't even be worth my time. I mean, she's, she's overweight, not to get into the female. I'm not gonna criticize her, but there's a lot of things. There's a lot of defects with this chick. But yet she's requiring so much of dudes and you have dudes that would bow down to her just because she's got a big behind or just because she's light skinned or just because she's got all that weave on her head. You have dudes that would that would bow to her, giving her power and thinking that she can do that with every guy that she come in contact with. But men have to take your power back. Men, you have to take your power back and you have to start by not getting involved with these relationships with your heart you can't go into it with your heart and see this dude i'm talking about he went into this relationship with his heart he's in it with his heart he loves this girl and she knows that he loves her and because she knows that he loves her she feels she could do anything to him and he has to obey her you know so he now has to take this physical abuse from her just to keep her and then you have females where guys just basically surrender to them she'll use them up and then she'll move on to the next guy while he's sitting there holding his heart in his hands while he's sitting there calling her texting her begging and pleading her to come back and now she's able to just put her foot on his neck and then if he come into some money she can use him because he's wide open to be used she got him right where she want him to be so men, you have to take your manhood back. Men have allowed females, men have allowed females to control their manhood for too long. Especially as females that tell a man quick, you know, I let you be the man. And like I mentioned in prior videos, a woman can't let you be what you already are. You just have to acknowledge and know that you are a man. And then take your rightful position in the universe see that's why so many black males are behind in life in society because you don't know your place you're trying to take the place of a woman and i'm gonna tell you something when you go into a relationship with your heart see men are more mental women should be more emotional see the bible even tells you to treat a woman as a weaker vessel because of the fact that she's emotional. But now you have more emotional males than you do women. And the women don't respect you, right? So when you go into this relationship with your heart and your hands and with your emotions, then that puts her in a position now where she has to take the dominant role. She now has to play the dominant role because you can't have two, uh, two people holding their hearts and their hand to each other. Just, it just not, it's not gonna happen. You know, once that man takes that dominant position, takes his position back now, she's going to be forced to now surrender, to submit to you like it was originally created to be. Either she's going to submit or she's going to move on and play that same game with somebody else. So just thought I had to say that feedback. Tell me what you think to next time. I'm fearless.